Hey guys, Wicked here. Welcome to another Clash of Clans video. Today we're doing a three-star series episode featuring Benjamin from X Loyal, who is performing uh, Gi He Ho, which is Giants, Healers, and Hogs. Um, as you can see, he's using three Healers, six Giants, and um, what's the main focus is the Giants go towards the Arch Queen to knock her out. Um, the good thing about Giants is they do a lot more damage than Golems, so um, that's another good way uh, to use them and also um, when you deploy the giants you got to make sure there's no uh, room for traps that they can get spring trapped or um, anything like that so as you can see um, he will be entering from the the northeast wall here and he's going to go towards the queen um, knock out those defenses and um, the good thing about healers is they allow the heroes to go in a bit of a rampage a little bit um, under heals so uh, you, you can see him rampage with the heal um, healers and the heroes in the northern northern northeast area of the base and uh, what the hogs do is they come from the south and um, as you can see I'll put the two giant bomb locations in right now so these are where the two giant bombs are and um, this is not good for hogs but with the way he uh, deploys his hogs um, allows not all the hogs to trip them only a few and he's uh, he uses those Teslas that are loco located here um, to uh, funnel most of the hogs into the center to kill the expo so uh, it's a really clever raid uh, I'll show you the uh, how he goes about it and um, I'll see you guys in the replay welcome to the replay and uh, we got uh, the Giants coming in from the northeast as promised and he will uh, deploy the heals behind them as well and I really like the Giants because they uh, do a lot more damage than the uh, the golems and the good thing about it is the last two updates the healers no longer um, trip over air mines or air bombs so um, I've seen this strategy go on a lot more um, now than before because of that and uh, watch him knock out the clan cast troops and the archer queen and uh, the barbarian king will be uh, doing a rampage around that area so now he sends in the hogs in a spread formation down south and um, the good thing about this is uh, he put the pre heals um, where those double bomb location is because they usually just trip one and uses those uh, Teslas to funnel uh, most of his hogs into the middle while some of the hogs trip over uh, some of the giant bombs. So now there's only um, single giant bombs to deal with which is okay. Um, won't wipe out the hogs at this stage. So there we go. Um, as you can see, the Barbarian King still alive under heals, and a couple of giants, and the Arch Queen comes in to join the party. And uh, it's quite a, a surgical a hog raid, really. And the Barbarian King um, on the defense is now dealing with the hogs, um, but will fail uh, soon once um, the Queen gets over there to kill her. So as you can see, the healers are keeping the uh, heroes alive which is awesome and there is a couple hogs left to do the clear up and um, it's probably in really important to have a few hogs left um, otherwise you'll find the heroes um, just won't have enough time to clear up the base so I'm going to fast forward this now um, the barbarian king on defense is dead and look how important it is to have a few hogs at the end just to do the clear up just for the time I hope you guys enjoyed that raid. If you've used it before, the Gi Hi Ho, uh, comment in the comments below and let me know what you think of it. Smack that like button, and if you're new to my channel, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next episode. Later, guys.